Hey everyone, I want to go over a case study for this client right here and I want to explain to you uh, the results we got, what was done in specific, uh, going over each and every single step, as well as why it was done and how you can do it too. So let's go over here the results. Now this was solely an off-page SEO strategy, so I call it an off-page SEO booster, a case study, which basically translates to a bunch of powerful links that get you results, which is what we're looking for in SEO, we're looking for results. So the niche is a domestic service niche, uh, the value, so the money in the niche is medium, so there's quite some money in the niche, and the competition is high as we can see here by the search volume here on this column. Now we can go over here the rank improvements as we can see here most of the keywords improved. Uh, we can also check them here in the actual rank tracker so you know I'm not just uh, inspecting the element. Uh, this is actually real. Again I'm refreshing here the page so you can see. And we can go over here some of the keywords for example this one went from uh, 69 position to 12th in just a couple of weeks. Uh, this one went from 18th to uh, 9. We can check this one as well, went from uh, 19th to right now 12th. You can see them here, uh, you can see them. most of them uh, went up. This one was the best one, uh, search volume of 110,000 per month, went from uh, 69, like I was saying before, to 10th, so, so to the first page. Sorry, I mentioned one week, but that's not true. This is about a month of work. And of course, this will keep on improving when we build a lot more links and when we wait a bit more uh, for some of the links to, to index. So these were the results. And the main goals were to build a strong link profile to get the pages ranking. That was the main goal. Then we also wanted to diversify the anchor text rotation. So uh, we built out a ton of links, which I'll go over here in just a second. And uh, one of our goals also was to uh, diversify the anchor text rotation. So use branded anchors, use exact match, long tail versions, naked URLs. We wanted to have a bit of everything to diversify the, what we call uh, anchor text rotation. Then the goal of this campaign was also uh, having it designed to get you results because you can build a ton of links uh, that don't actually move the needle depending on exactly what you want to do with the SEO campaign. You can, for example, you can just build links to diversify the anchor text rotation. Uh, less powerful links, for example, you can build out foundation links, which we also did here, uh, but these won't, won't move the needle much. Uh, the goal with this is just to diversify your anchor text rotation if you feel like you are maybe over-optimizing. but. This campaign was designed to uh, get you results, not just to do something specific. So that's why we built out a ton of different links. Um, now, let's go over exactly then what was done. And again, keep in mind that um, on-page SEO was done one week prior. So we didn't just do this uh, off-page. So we didn't just build a bunch of these links. We actually did some on-page SEO before, because as you know, SEO is made out of two things, the on-page SEO and the off-page SEO, and you need to get these two right in order to get a site ranked. Of course, you can solely do on-page and get rank improvements, you can also solely do off-page and get rank improvements, but if you want the best of both worlds, you need to do these two properly to get the most uh, amount of uh, rank improvements for your work. Okay, so just wanted to clear that out and let you know that, in fact, we did some on-page SEO to the site. Now. Here's the money site. And here's basically everything we did to get uh, these results right here. And as you can see, these are competitive keywords, 110,000 searches per month, almost 50,000 searches per month, 700,000 searches per month. So these are competitive keywords and all of them are ranking uh, higher than they were before. So from 69 to 10 to the first page, from 52 to 9 to the first page. So first page, first page, first page. All these are on the first page and they were nowhere to be seen. And like I said, these will keep on improving throughout the weeks as we let the link settle down and build a couple of more links to, to these pages. Now, here's exactly what we did and I won't go over these in any particular order. I'm just going to go over them uh, by the order they're here. Firstly, of course, and this is a classic, uh, we did some PBN links. These are basically, if you don't know, uh, powerful links placed on niche articles on a private network. And these, and these give you both power and relevancy. Relevancy because the articles are niche ones and power because PBN links are usually super powerful. And these were placed on Trustflow 50 plus uh, domains and Trustflow 30 plus domains. And if you ever want to get your hands in one of these, you can, of course, go to uh, vet.com and grab them for yourself. Again, in this video, I'm not trying to sell you anything, but since I'm going over what we did, these are the Trustflow 50 links and these are the uh, Trustflow 30 links. And uh, since I'm here, I might as well tell you that the this everything we did here, uh, all of this, all of these, all of these links are inside of uh, this package right here. So this is the off-page package I did for, for this site and where I attained these results. 
uh, it was uh, this package right here. But showing you this is not my goal right now, so let's head back to the whiteboard. So as I was saying, PBN links, um, these are super powerful links coming from uh, Trustflow 90, sorry, 5230 domains. And um, of course the anchor is seamlessly included in the anchor text. So if you have a PBN article or any article, uh, you wanna have it written right here, and then your anchor text seamlessly included inside the article. And then the rest of the article, of course, you don't want the anchor text to be here somewhat alone and not included inside the actual article. Then of course, uh, guest posts. And uh, I haven't got much to say about these because these are super straightforward. It's a, a link. Uh, from a, a site, a powerful site that people can guest post on. Uh, if you want to learn a bit more about guest posts, you can always uh, search it on YouTube. Uh, I don't actually sell guest posts. Uh, there are some people here on Vetted that do, uh, so you can grab some from them. Uh, then uh, press releases. Uh, these are really powerful, and our goal with this was to get eyeballs on the site, link juice, and increase the brand awareness. That was the main goal. And the uh, articles, so this is basically you write an article, you write a press release, uh, talking about the business or the product and then you have links to your site and this article was placed on 400 plus news outlets which was great to get some eyeballs and some power to the of course money site so press release always great to do uh, one or two um, on a monthly basis to get the juices going to the money site and some eyeballs on uh, your product your service your brand and to get some brand recognition so that Google finds you as an authority. Because if you are posted uh, on a bunch of news sites, and of course, when you talk about news sites or news outlets, we're talking about uh, authoritative ones. So if Google sees that you're placed on a bunch of these authoritative news outlets, it'll know that you're in fact the authority in your niche and that people are talking about you. So it will increase your brand's power in Google's eyes. So that's why we always do press releases. And again, if you go on here to Vetted, I also sell PR uh, PR services. Actually, last week I got a client of mine on Yahoo Finance, uh, so we managed so we managed to get him a link from Yahoo Finance. And if you want to get all these, you can of course uh, do it here if you'd like. And then of course, as I was saying before, the foundation links. This was actually the first step, and uh, we built out a ton of foundation links. So article submissions, profiles, video sharing sites. So Web 2.0. These are the the basic links anyone can build. And the main goals here was to build a strong foundation from for what's to come. And what's to come here are the PBN links, the guest posts, and the niche edits. So we want to build a strong foundation for what's to come. So think of it as a pyramid. And here on the base are the foundation links that are on here. We might have the PBMs, the niche edits, and the guest posts. And our goal is to build this foundation and, of course, diversify your anchor text rotation. And I have a video solely on this, if you can watch it, but basically what I do is I follow this, uh, of course, not exactly, but to some extent. Uh, ideally, you want to have 70% of branded anchors, 20% of naked URL anchors, 5% of generic anchors, less than 5% of partial match anchors, and less than 1% of exact match anchors. And since on PBNs, niche edits, and guest posts, uh, you'll be using, of course, your uh, generic partial and exact because these are the most powerful anchors you can have. You want, of course, use them on the most powerful links you have. You, of course, use these ones on the less powerful links, which are the foundation links, because, because of course, you don't want to spend your, let's say, credit of uh, anchors on the of good anchors on the foundation links because these are the weakest links you can build. So there's no point of using uh, the weakest links. Uh, with uh, these uh, more powerful anchors. And by powerful, I mean, let's say you have a niche added from an amazing domain, super powerful with actual traffic. Uh, you want to, of course, use your exact or partial match anchors because these are the ones you want to rank for. Now, we can also look at this. Again, I have a video solely on this, but basically what I do is use links from social media uh, for branded anchors. For naked URL anchors, I use foundation links, web 2.0s, generic anchors, which are the click here, uh, learn more, see more. I use guest posts, profile links, uh, and press releases. Uh, partial match anchors, I use just PBNs, and exact match anchors, I use the heavy eater PBN links, uh, niche edits, and other big boy links. But this is, again, a video for another time, and I have a video solely on this if you don't watch it. Now, moving on to uh, niche edits. Uh, these are basically one of the most powerful types of links you can get, because not only you get the power and relevancy just like you get on the PBN links, because your links are posted on a powerful domain, but you also get the relevancy because your links are posted on a niche relevant article. Then all of these are manually done, just like the PBN links, but they're also posted on sites with real traffic. And that's where the real power comes from. These are amazing sites that people actually go visit to read the articles and you're getting links from these sites uh, exactly. And if you're watching this um, before the 30th of July, I'm actually running a $500 giveaway. 
so you can win $500 in niche edits from Omer. He's, he's right here in, on the homepage. His niche edits are super, super powerful. Uh, you can see here samples uh, down here. The DR is super high. The referring domains are also amazing and the traffic uh, is out of this world. It's, it's, it's real. These are real sites where you can get links from. And like I said, I'm running a $500 giveaway and all you have to do to win is just buy anything from Vettel until the 30th and then I'll basically choose uh, anyone that bought any service from Vettel doesn't really matter the price or the actual service. You just need to buy something. And again, in the 30th of July, uh, I'll be doing a live stream uh, choosing the winner. And yeah, but moving on to uh, the next one. So after all of this was done, we went and did some EDU profile links. So the goal with this was to increase our DA, our domain authority or, or, or DR, if you measure it through Ahrefs. And uh, basically links from EDU sites are great to build a trust in Google sites. And this is just a step that I've been doing for years now and I've noticed it works and uh, it's great. I also do some dot, uh, .gov links included in here. So I also do some gov links, but these are a bit harder to get, but they're also done and they all point to towards the money site. Like all of this is pointing towards the money site. We have here some tier two link building, but I'll go over this in just a second. Now moving on to novelty links. And our goal with this is of course to uh, get powerful links pointing to our money site, but also to diversify our link profile. And what I mean by diversify your link profile is to get links that your competitors might not have. And these are links from Reddit, from actual Amazon, amazon.com, not, not the subdomain, Telegram, and a couple of others. So you can get these links uh, pointing to your site, and this will be a great way to uh, stand out from your competition and have some links on your link profile that they might not have. So again, this is a great thing to have, and of course, it also builds up power and link juice sent directly to our money site, which is what we want. Then q and links, and again, I have a video solely on this. Uh, it's six minutes of pure value. You can watch it if you want. I'll leave a link in the description, but our goal with this is to basically uh, send organic traffic and targeted traffic to your site. And these link to our money site as well. Again, I urge you to watch the video that I have linked in the description because uh, this is a great way to get some traffic to your site and this helps with the rankings as well. Then the classic Google stacking, uh, these are links directly from Google. This helps diversify your link portfolio, helps diversify your anchor text profile. And of course, these are trustworthy links directly from Google itself. And I have a video solely on this as well, and which I'll link in the description. After that, we did some entity stacking and I also have a video solely on this, but these are links from uh, cloud services. For, so for example, from AWS, uh, Microsoft's cloud, IBM, and let's, for example, open here the one from Google Cloud and let's see what we have here. And this is basically a link from here. Uh, you have, of course, a niche relevant article. You, have, you can have a map embed. You can link out to several authoritative sources. And of course, link back to your client. I won't click any of this because I want to keep this private. But let's also just check if this one is indexed. It should be indexed, of course, because this index, yeah, it's indexed. So it uh, is a very powerful link from uh, several authoritative sources. Again, Microsoft's cloud, Amazon, AWS cloud, like Liz, Netfly, Bitbucket, Google cloud, IBM cloud. So we have all these powerful links pointing directly to our sites from niche relevant articles and that actually indexed. So these are great. And yeah, after all this, we of course go over to the tier two linking and these are basically um, lower quality PBN links that will link out to some of these properties just to power them up or to index them when they need some force indexing. All of these or most of these will index naturally, but if you want to power up and force the indexing, you can do so with this tier two PBN links. And I have solely a video on this as well, but say this is your money site and this is your tier ones, your tier twos will power up your tier ones. And of course the link juice will also flow out to your main property. Say of course you have building, uh, Say, for example, this was for a more local client and you had citations, you can also use these tier two links to link to your citations and the citations, of course, will link to your money site. But we have solely a video on that. I don't want to go over that right now. But after all of this was done, the reality is this is all good. But what really matters is, does it work? And yes, it does work. It did work for this client. As you can see here, these are the results which I showed you earlier. All these keywords went up. Just take a look at this search volume. It's crazy. 110,000 searches per month, 50,000 searches per month. These are great results and they're somewhat common if you do some proper on-page SEO. Uh, this again was solely an off-page booster package, uh, which did work and I'm really proud of it and I thought I'd record this short video uh, explaining to you what was done, exactly what was done. And I'm not hiding anything. I'm not hiding anything. My goal is not to hide anything. You can build all these yourself if you want to, 
but if you don't outsource them uh, i actually sell each one of these services individually uh, if you go here to my profile you'll see that you can pick up the core targeted traffic you could pick up the google stacking the foundation links the tier 2 pbn links which are right here the cloud stacking then we have some social seo e links you have a bunch of stuff of course you can pick all this uh, by yourself if you want or if you just want to pick up the package uh, it's this one right here it's the off-page seo package and um yeah that's basically it uh, before you go though let me just tell you that i'm running a 500 giveaway for the niche edits i mentioned earlier and if you want to grab this now it's the time because when you grab this any any package doesn't really matter you're automatically entered to win the 500 a niche edit giveaway so again like i was saying before at the end of the month i'll choose a buyer that bought anything from vetted and will give him or her a credit of 500 dollars in niche edits so if you want to grab it now it's the time because you're entered to win a this giveaway which is which is a great uh, power booster on top of all this and yeah that's basically it uh, i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you like it i hope you like videos like these case studies where i'm fully transparent and i don't basically hide anything of course i'll hide the client information because that's somewhat sensitive but yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you soon cheers